All right, so <clears throat> I want to look at, let me butcher these names right quick. <laughs> Lisa, Lisa, I'm already, that was the easy one. <laughs> Lisa. <laughs> oh, I'm going to go play Lisa tag. Lisa Haberstead and Robert Huffman. That's all I'm going to, I'm, I'm trying that again. No, they are, they have been charged here in Pittsburgh with ethnic intimidation because there is a Russian, Russian, Lord Jesus. Now I can't, I can't say the easy ones. Russian citizen here. I mean, okay. First of all, because I don't even, I don't mean to make it even sound like, oh, there's a Russian citizen here. Like, oh, there's a diming in the room. No, there's a person here who happens to be Russian type of thing. Like he's, you, you know, there's Russian people everywhere. So it's not like there's some anomaly. They're not a unicorn. This, this just happens to be a Russian person living in Pittsburgh. Now, some people were speculating that the reason this person was singled out is he might be the son of an oligarch. But they don't know that. They were just saying that in the comments. Now, oligarch or not, these two people went outside. Lisa and Robert went outside his house. Their 64 and 66 was outside, you know, giving him the whole go back to Russia bit type of thing. So they have been charged with ethnic intimidation outside of his house. So how's this going to work out for them? Lisa or Lisa <laughs> Lisa and Robert Lisa and Robert I'm do Robert since he's here three of swords six of Pentacles huge fine uh, six of swords and the ace of cups he moves on from this but he is separated from some money here um yeah huge fine for him but he goes on about his business lisa um she's gonna start something new apparently or there's some sort of new networking or communications that she's trying to work on so it doesn't look like she's giving this up or taking this away. She may be going to Facebook or some sort of online thing, which can cause some confusion within the community, which means that somebody else may target for her, but she ain't let it go. 